Here we go, the final level of the game. Now this is not the final level of the walkthrough, but you should have completed the final castle before doing this because that's how the game works. But I'm showing you secret levels before attempting the final castle because the final castle should be the biggest video of it all. Now right off the bat they want to kill you with these wigglers. So don't get killed. Actually, the safest idea, yeah, is to just let go of your baby. And then, oh my gosh, I can't believe I just did that. Uh, that is just amazing. <laughs> that is just amazing on so many levels. You don't know how excited I am. Um, over here, you just want to go underneath that, You unless you want an egg. Which you should have already. And then let's go on to the next deadly part of this level. Checkpoint. And I should have come here before hitting the checkpoint. Time to die. Alrighty, here is your next challenge. Right off the bat, they're gonna give you a maze of spikes. Take the center and pound it. Do not, do not go into the checkpoint right now. Do not do that. Because what you want to do right now is to duck when the when, when he wants to eat you, duck and move this way. Make sure you have a power block while you're at it and a, and a winged cloud as well. First off, now, this is a, a maze because in the other name is also called Crazy Maze. What you want to do is come here first. This is the left side. You just want to go up there and. Stars. That's your red coin. You have only one red coin as of this part of the level. Or in this portion of, the, of this crazy maze. Maybe that's why they call it Endless World of Yoshis. And then you have to. You can either traverse down, or you can just be like me and take the center and pound it. Then, come to the right and make sure you have your power because the enemies are about to kill you. So, get ready when the thing comes in and then use a power block. Yeah, you saw me there. You did not see what I mean. This is also a very good place to use it. But, if you can make it, just make it and don't and forget about it. Um, so yeah, same thing. Take the upper door. It is a big maze, so do not get scared. The first time I did this, it got scared. This is only part one. Like this entire portion, this castle portion, it's part one. There are, if I'm right, there are three huge parts to this level. Um, and, I'll, and I'll elaborate more on that. So, do that, and then once again, traverse downwards. But now, what you want to do is you do want to go to the checkpoint. So come to the checkpoint. And then come to the left. This time you can ignore everything else that is here. Because you've already gotten the coins and you don't want to die. Wow. Alright. Alright. Let's go. Um, Alright. So here is part two. That was... Part one was the big... Was the dodging. Now this is part two. That was part two. The castle. Now over here, you're gonna enter the right door and you're given another two doors to pick. Now, this door will take you to the exit of the course which requires a key. This, this course requires, takes you to one uh, half a part. This is half part of, of part three, I guess. Um, you do want to do that. Um, and then, you want to, uh, over here... Okay, now if you stomp it, it's okay. You, you won't... It's not gone forever. Make sure that you, you jump on the red one while it's jumping. And use your X to get it. Then make sure you eat this thing. Don't worry, you have tons of um, middle wings to go, so losing is okay. Now over here, you don't want to just let it go. What you want to do is you want to just... Okay, that was a dumb move. Um, Alright, plan B. Uh, this is what the game wants you to do, and that is to use these... 
what they want you to do is to use yeah you let, let them spray bubbles and then let use the bubbles to get to where you want to go and that will get you one red coin do not worry about red coins you're currently doing you fine all right over here now you can do you can do some stuff but I'm just gonna go to the door first we're gonna have to do this later anyways all right and this door takes us back here and then come to the right we're gonna do the same thing except towards the right uh, do not kill yourself don't let the the skeleton fish can get very annoying so it is to your advantage to get rid of it if possible and use your flutter kick to your advantage um, take the door this time instead of going up there you come to the left and then this door will take you to where you want to be, which is the same place as the other room, but we're gonna come this way because we gotta go get our next flower and coins. Alright, as always, open up the beanstalk, the happy sunflower, and over here, this might get a little bit tricky, but what you want to do is bring it to the edge, alright, pound it, pound it, and pound it again. And you want to make sure you push it to go over the spikes. Activate that. Hit the switch and then push it. Then you'll be able to push it over. And then you can use this as a stepping stone to get that. Then we can move on. Um, come up here. And we're going to meet the more monkey madness people. But before you begin, make sure you jump and jump. That one coin is your red coin, and then make sure you still seeding. No! Yeah, okay, good. Ah. Get rid of both of them if you want to. You can just unlock that and then right now do not go into the door because you didn't do this just now. Um, take this boulder, chom rock, push it. Let Inertia do the job and then let this do whack it to unlock that. Take the beanstalk out. This is fun fundamental for completing the maze and for getting 100%. Get the key. Get that, and then take the middle ring. Then, go back down. This pretty much covers part two. Uh, part three. This is part three. Alright, then choose either side. Go to where you want to be. Um, whoa! Whoa, don't let the thing spit and... Because he's going to kill you. He spits lava and you're gonna die. Um, yeah, so take the right door and don't go up the next round. So, so over here, this door here. Don't go up. Go to the right. And then come over to the top door. Now this door will take you to when you go to the other door. Um, you may want to eat the missile bills, but I'm just gonna go. And this will take you to part of the castle um, and this part is really really simple um, now you want to just roll along roll the block like that and then stay there let the block stay there and then jump and then you pretty much complete part 4 now moving on to part 5, you're out of the castle, but you're back here. Um, now you can do two things, you can either straight away hit that middle ring, but what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to, actually, make sure you have this big shy guy facing the left, then he can help you get that, 
and I'm going to go to checkpoint, and I'll see you guys if I die. Alright, right now, push this block along its own way. Don't let it exceed the flippers there, the pinball flippers. Make sure what you do right now is just unlock it. Make sure it's dominating that, and then stay there. Use that to open a key. Eat the watermelon. Take this way, it'll help you get you an extra life, and that'll get you stars. Um, what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna make a little detour um, so that I don't have to do this again later. And that is that. I'm gonna get this flower first. How do you get this flower? Make sure you notice the baseball dude. Make sure it's facing towards the right. Okay. Now, now if you fail, don't worry, it's in the end of the world. And if you're out of eggs, uh, get more eggs. Because I want to get this part done with first. So I have to worry. Speaking of which, extra life. Then come to your right. And. Yeah. Do that, stand here and you can get your flower. Then we can move on to the left. The rocks. Then you can just roll along this way. Jump on that. And then you can enter the thing. You don't have to jump on that, you can just uh, take a long jump and flutter. Make sure you're holding down your B button for acceleration. And then run. Run. It's a mad dash from here. You fail at any point of time, you gotta start from the top. Believe it. You might run out, but you have nothing to worry because it's all for the you. Over here, jump. Run a circle. Jump just once like that and then glide. Do not be misled by the arrows. You miss any coins here, don't worry. Just make sure you get the star. Jump twice there. Jump. Come down. Hit the star. Hit the star again. And you can get coins, but I'm just gonna run. I just wanna get out of this place. And then, take the pipe. And you have pretty much completed part 5, and now we're moving on to the final part, which is fairly difficult. Um, so over here, flutter jump, you can do that. Now, make sure you're ready to battle enemies. Why? You've got these dudes. Now, remember, you still can have items. Now, what, if you want 100%, you can. You're gonna come this way. Jump on the head and come this way. Now, you have to utilize the opponent's strength for your advantage. To get up here. Now, either, yeah, you gotta use their eggs to jump, and holy heck, I just did that in one take. Check, make sure you only have one more flower, and then jump. If you took the other route, you won't be able to get the final flower, just so you know. And back to the first level. Kamek is still trying. He's still trying to kill you, so get ready. Apparently, you won't hit, he won't hit you. He's not aiming to hit you, so don't worry about it. Back to the training course, World Zero. No, actually, it's still World Six Secret. Oh my gosh, I just did that in one hit. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I did it. And this is a really, really hard level. Then after this, all that's left is... The final castle. Now you can do that. Get yourself a flower and... As always, before you battle, we're gonna do this. I'm gonna go back to the walkthrough account and I'm gonna complete the final castle. And let you guys see. So that is the hardest level in the game and ironically, unlike more Monkey Madness, uh, Kamek's Revenge, I only took this at one try, so, whoa, I think this is more of a puzzle and if it's a first time going through, you will have 
problem with it. Let's play some cards and hope not to get connect. I might. But doesn't matter, I beat the hardest level in the game, what could stop me now? Doesn't matter to me. Alright, all that's left is Baby Bowser. So we're gonna go to our walkthrough account and complete that. So as you see here, um, I have not completed that yet. So that's just so you know, that's a secret level. And then we're gonna move on. Let's move on to the final level. 